are chemistry fun. It's a mole pencil because we were learning about the mole, which is a unit in chemistry that represents 6.02 times 10 to the 23rd particles. And my teacher tries to make it fun, and she gives us these little mole pencils, and they're pretty adorable. She also has this giant mole, this big, like, stuffed one that she sewed, and she has, like, these little ones that she puts in beakers, and one of them she cut in half so she could have half a mole, and then she colored the stuffing red because she wanted to be grody. She also has this guy that's completely unrelated to science, and his name is Norm. He's in, like, this old desk, and he is basically just a bunch of stuffed clothes and a mask. He's kind of creepy, too. I like my chemistry teacher. Also, my gym teacher from last year, she let me have this book. I thought she was just letting me borrow it, but I guess she wanted me to keep it, so I'm really happy, and she says that if there's any other books that I want to read, she would let me borrow them, and she mentioned this one book, I can't remember what it's called, but she just bought it, and she said as soon as she's done with it, she's gonna let me borrow it. I wish she was my gym teacher still. She was my tennis coach just recently. The tennis ended. I don't know if she's gonna be the tennis coach next year, but I really hope so, because she's really nice, as you can tell by her giving me free books. I don't know if the camera picks it up, but I just think you should know that I can see my breath in my room right now. We need new windows, but my hands are starting to get really numb. So now I'm wearing a hat and gloves. Don't want to catch cold. And other news, my school is full of scumbags. In my photo class, somebody somehow stole the memory cards and the cameras. This way we can't take pictures. Why do people do this? They're probably selling them, and I know people want money, but why do you have to be a douche about it? Get a job. I might be getting a job soon, by the way. I put in an application. I'm really hoping I get a job there. It's a bookstore, and it's amazing. But anyway, now for a project that we were going to do, which is surrealism, we were supposed to take three pictures and combine them, and then and write a story about it. But now we have to go online and take five pictures and combine those and then write a story about that. Plus we have a camera of our own. Which I do. It's just not very high quality. But I'm gonna use it anyway because I already had an idea in my head. And it's also really annoying for the school because that's lots of money and we still need things for photo class and for the school in general. I don't like kids who steal. And this isn't the first time things have been reported as stolen. Last year, lots of people had their iPods stolen. Even Val had her cell phone stolen. So we gotta be careful. And now I have to be really, really careful because besides my mom's camera, I also have the yearbook club's camera in my purse because I'm taking pictures around school for yearbook club. And I don't want somebody stealing that because then I would be in trouble too. Also about yearbook club, I was the only person there. There were all these people there last time. Lots of them I even knew. So they were like, congratulations, you're the only one that showed up. That's kind of the way it was last year too. Except for last year, not even the people from the class showed up. Just me. So that was nice because then I got $20 or so off of my yearbook. It didn't really save me any money because my mom was paying for my yearbook. Could have easily have stolen that money, but I didn't because I'm a good kid. So now I'm in three fun regulars. I'm playing chocolate bars again for our sophomore class, except our sophomore class is very enthusiastic about anything, so I don't know how much we're really going to get. Then for French Club, I'm selling these no-bake cheesecakes which are harder to sell because you don't get them immediately and it's just a mix, it's not a ready-made cheesecake. But my aunt took them to where she works and she says she sold quite a few already. And I'm also selling giant coloring books. They're like, big. For environmental clubs, which I'm also one of the only members of. I was late to environmental club because I had to stay after her test and the person who ran it looked really relieved that I showed up because barely nobody else did. Today was interesting and generally good. I hope we find the person who took the memory cards and I hope justice is served because they really ticked me off. Also, please let us know if you want to be in the Secret Santa project. Ashlyn says she wants to do it. I want to do it. Val obviously wants to do it. And I guess Simon said he might do it. Anybody else, please put in your input. Anyway, have a lovely day everybody. DFTBA.